So I was sitting in the bathroom and was thinking, hmm, this bathroom is kind of boring. Everything's pretty much one color and it doesn't have much personality and it's the bathroom or I guess powder room that everyone uses when they come over. It's right off the bar area. So I wanted it to be a little more bold and I've kind of been having the urge to paint a room black. So why not give it a try in a little bathroom? This was totally impulsive, but I headed to Lowe's to pick out some black paint swatches and some green for my kitchen cabinets, but that's another day. I ended up going with Dark Kettle Black by Valspar, which compared to the popular color Tricorn Black by Sherwin-Williams, it's just a tad bit lighter and a less saturated black, but once it's on the wall, it looks like a true black. Before I began painting, I took all the things off the wall like the mirror and the toilet paper and towel holders and the outlet and light switch covers. Then I taped off all the spots that would be hard to edge in without getting paint all over and decided to freehand most of it because I usually get better results. Tape just doesn't always work out well for me. It always seems to bleed through in spots. And I decided to give the crown molding a fresh coat of paint and getting it on the gray that way when I do the black, I have a nice crisp line. No turning back now, it was time to paint the black and this powder is very small so getting shots with my camera was not the easiest because I was blocking it half the time, but I tried my best. And little tip, if you can find a rubber band, put it around your can and use that to get the excess paint off your brush so it just goes right back into your paint instead of using the side of the can and getting it all messy. I edged everything twice first and got back as far as I possibly could with a paintbrush around the toilet. That was the most annoying part and it was hard to get in the corners with my big brush so I used a little brush to touch those up too. Also changed out the hardware on the vanity from black to gold so there was more contrast. So this is what it looked like before. And this is the end result. It went from really boring to kind of bold and it feels actually cozy in here. I'd love to find an old vintage mirror from a thrift store but until I find one I like I'm just gonna keep my old one up. But what a difference just a can of paint can make. I still kept everything pretty much the same besides changing out the hardware. And for $36 for a can of paint, it feels like an entirely new space. I know it's supposedly against the rules to paint a small space dark, but for a powder room, you're not spending a ton of time in here. So who cares? Rules were meant to be broken anyways. And actually makes me want to paint more things black. Let me know what you guys think. Would you dare paint a room black? I'd love to know. As always, thanks for watching and until next time, bye.